Hi, I'm Martin Bernier, Technical Director at Future Electronics. Today we will be talking about switch mode power supplies. A switch mode power supply is different than a linear power supply because it includes a switching regulator in order to efficiently convert electrical power. It transfers power from a source to a load while converting voltage and current. Switch mode power supplies can also be lighter and smaller than linear power supplies because of the reduced size and weight of the transformer. There are differences between linear and switch mode power supplies. A linear power supply provides the required output voltage by dissipating excess power in ohmic losses and regulates output current or voltage by dissipating excess power in the form of heat. Therefore, its maximum power efficiency is proportional to the voltage output compared to the voltage input since the difference is wasted. The linear power supply shown here is fairly simple in concept and basic implementation. A transformer scales the AC line voltage to a value consistent with the required maximum DC output voltage level. The AC voltage is then rectified into a DC voltage. Large electrolytic capacitors filter the AC ripple voltage superimposed on the unregulated DC voltage. Power transistors control the difference between the unregulated DC rail voltage and the regulated output DC voltage. An error amplifier compares the output voltage to a reference in order to regulate the output at the required setting. Finally, an output filter capacitor further reduces AC output noise, ripple, and lowers output impedance for an idle voltage source. On the other hand, a switch mode power supply regulates output current or voltage by switching idle storage elements such as capacitor and inductor using different electrical configuration. Output is regulated using duty cycle control and transistor which are switched either fully on or fully off. This ensures that there are minimal resistive loss between input and load. The ideal efficiency of a switch mode power supply is 100% as all input power is delivered to the load and no power is lost. A switch mode power supply with a good design can actually reach an efficiency over 95%. This basic traditional switching power supply illustrated here is a bit more complex compared to the linear power supply. The AC line voltage is rectified and then filtered to provide an unregulated high voltage DC rail to power the following DC-DC inverter circuit. Power transistors switching at tens to hundreds of kilohertz impose a high voltage, high frequency AC pulse waveform on the transformer primary. The AC pulse voltage is scaled by the transformer turns ratio to a value consistent with the required DC output voltage. This transformer's secondary AC voltage is rectified into a pulse DC voltage. An LC output filter averages the pulse into a continuous DC voltage at the power supply's output. As with a linear power supply, a error amplifier compares the DC output voltage against a reference to regulate the output at the required setting. A modulator circuit converts the error amplifier signal into a high-frequency pulse width modulated waveform to drive the switching power transistors. There are several advantages to using switch mode power supply instead of linear power supply. They are very low power dissipation when the switching transistor is outside of its active region, smaller size and lighter weight. Switching between states allows the current to be monitored and controlled better than a constantly running power supply. Since power can fluctuate, a power supply that is constantly running at the required voltage can cause a blowout with a power spike. On the other hand, a switch mode power supply can regulate the power passing through it cut off the supply and reduce the possibility for a blowout. Switch mode power supplies are often used to power electronic devices such as consumer electronic, personal computers, central power distribution, battery chargers, vehicles and lighting. For more information about switch mode power supplies, visit our website at futureelectronics.com.